Hello again my good YouTubers. Today I had my Skysig order arrive. The ordering process, because they were so for so called dealing with a tremendously large amount of requests and large demand, took about two weeks. Uh in fact actually as I say it took about what two weeks and a couple of days. Give or take. But finally I got it today. Uh, special delivery. Uh, I'm not sure whether it came from the UK as advertised. Let's have a look. Uh, Royal Mail tract if undelivered, please return to Lindingo, West Lothian. Yeah, as I say, it obviously was you know came from there, but it's actually a Canadian company. Well, where it came, you know, where it comes from. Um, quite impressive. Uh, I'm part of me. Uh, I'm comparing the results, obviously, to the electronic cigarette companies, uh, which is the DSC one zero eight, which I purchased from Totally Wicked. Uh, with uh, again, they've got their um, just below the video, they've got their discount codes, so you can get some discount on this. This is the Sky Cigarette. Um, it's obviously a Canadian company distributing here in the UK. It's other known in the America as the Blue Cigarette, B L U E Cig. This. This is quite surprising, to be honest. I mean, look at the size comparisons difference between the two cigarettes. I mean, I've got the black top on. Let me change that. Let me put a, a what do you call it? A, one of the um, brown or natural, as they call them. There we go. You can see now in the camera the clear differences in size. This is a complete you know, uh, unit to this one. This one is clearly more of the normal size of the cigarette. That's that's the way they've done it. And it seems to work well. The funny part about it is, the cartridge in this, you'll probably get about five to ten puffs before the cartridge is completely empty. Um, I've put a few drops of e-liquid into these. These are not refillable cartridges. These come in these um, little box packages like this. Sorry for the uh, lack of light, of course, but um, let's say little tiny boxes um, with a pack of f there's five in a box like this. And down inside the cartridges, there is uh, you can see that shiny thing. That's a little piece of tin foil capped over the top. And let me get out the uh, insert here so you can have a look. This is the insert piece. This is what's inside of them, which is very similar to the DS901. But as you can see, it's got this little tin foil cap over the top to uh, hold the liquid in so it doesn't, you know, fall out. And then obviously that goes into there as so as you can see obviously as I say I've not pushed it down let's give it a little push down shall we on the edge it's in there now so and that's what you get uh, now this guy's cigarette comes with a PCC which is um, your carry case personal carry case with sky cigarette on it lovely flip top whatever there's a charge the cartridge charge uh, there's the battery that's being charged uh, at the moment as you can see it's plugged in you get you know into a uh, mains adapter um, this box here also has a battery inside it um, contained inside the box it's a, it's a full working PCC box unfortunately it's not compatible with any of the stuff that comes from totally wicked like the this is the DC DSE 108 um, obviously, as I say, because it's a lot bigger, it won't fit in the box, unfortunately. So this uh, bit unlocking there, I was hoping that it was going to be the same battery model uh, and whatever, but no, it's not. Um, this is the exact same size as a uh, generally a packet of cigarettes. Here is a box of Benson and Hedges. 
not advertising smoking by the way I have to say that as you can see look the there's the size comparison equal with there it's just a little tiny bit bigger um, give you an idea as I say that's what quarter of an inch six millimeter a little bit bigger than a normal packet of cigarettes but this is the side box type cigarettes I've got a a normal Benson's packet here actually there we go look at that normal Benson's still yep yeah, still about six millimeters off the bottom there flush at the top look about six millimeters off the bottom so this is actually very close to a normal packet of cigarettes width wise let's just do that it's exactly the same width exactly the same width but just a little longer um, considering this got a battery in it, it's got um, one, two, three, four, five. Position for five cartridge fills. One battery charge point, which charges from the internal battery, uh, USB or the mains adapter, and has spot for your e-cigarette to fall in. So you've got the uh, cartridge spot for five then you've got the battery then you've got your e-cigarette down here now what's quite surprising is this has got an atomizer which looks very similar let's get the light on it to a 401 402 style of um, atomizer it's a lot smaller and the threads are very fine they're a very fine small thread which I was quite surprised at really you can't really see that I'm sorry for the bad camera as I say you know some of us can't afford really big cameras so um, this is Sky cigarette and obviously the cartridge here now. Obviously, I've used a bit of e liquid or whatever, but I've changed this. This one on here is actually the magic menthol flavor, it is magic menthol, which seems an interesting one actually because it tastes exactly like an after eight. I don't know whether you know you've, you, you've tried an after eight where you are, um, but here in the UK we have a thing called the after, after eights. So I don't know what other countries have them, but nevertheless it tastes exactly like an after eight and that's what they call magic menthol um... so you have to take a few puffs really to get the um, atomizer going to get actually you know any kind of smoke out of it but that is a really lovely menthol flavour. It's very mild. It's not like tree balls or anything. It's exactly like an after eight. No tobacco taste, no nothing. This is a medium strength cartridge. Um, again, they haven't put any milligrammage on the strengths. Uh, I don't know whether they've listed that on their website, actually, as I say. I mean, I don't know. As I say, I went out and bought this primarily because it come with a PCC case on this style because the only PCC cases I've able to see are for the Titan uh, which is the 510 um, which is obviously a longer, it's a longer, more slimmer case um, so this, as you can see, this, this red light is doing some very dodgy things actually it's, uh, I'm not too sure whether the connector is quite fully in with it but at the same, I mean, there's a blue light on the USB side what I actually can't show you because that's underneath the desk plugged in but um, it's uh, it's behaving with some flashes, so I'm going to have to uh, read the destruction manual to find out what those flashes actually indicate and what they mean. Um, 